NASCAR season revs up this weekend as the Daytona 500 will open the 2021 Monster Energy Cup Series and with it, three new racing teams, including one led by a Northeast Ohio newcomer. John Doss has more. Hinkley native Matt Tift was one of NASCAR's up-and-coming young talents, debuting on the Monster Energy Cup Series for the first time in 2018 at the age of just 22, until a trackside seizure in 2019 led to an epilepsy diagnosis and ultimately the end of his racing career. I worked my whole life to make it to the top of NASCAR, and I had no idea what to do. What Tift did was buy a team, joining an ownership group in late 2020 to purchase a NASCAR charter beating out some stiff competition. Literally, Michael Jordan, um, Justin Marks, who eventually became to be um, teamed up with Pitbull, and all these other guys, we had Floyd Mayweather in there. Like, it was a big, big, big names in there. And somehow, don't know how we pulled it off, um, we ended up getting the team and the charter. And at 24 years old, Tift is the youngest owner in NASCAR. And what better way to debut his new team? And our very first race is the biggest race in America, the Daytona 500. So. We're jumping right in the weeds with it. Digging Northeast Ohio roots into the Southern dominated sport. It's kind of the, you know, nobody expects anything from us. And the other owners are Michael Jordan and Pitbull. Like, are you kidding me? So to me, it's a little bit of the Cleveland against the world mentality with us that we can build something, we can become something great. 